Megit currently has four divisions. We've got airframe systems, engine systems, energy and industrial and service and support. Historically, a lot of Megit's factories don't employ current state-of-the-art technology. We do a lot of work off system, so whether that be on Excel spreadsheets, on other documents. We thought there was an opportunity to try and integrate all of these systems together so we can get a constant data flow through of a product when it started to be manufactured all the way through to the end of line. The, the project is trying to address the, uh, the uh, fundamental challenges that the aerospace sector is currently facing. Uh, although the sector is moving towards the automation, there's still some areas where human dexterity is required because of the complexity of the operations. At the MTC, we have been supporting the consortium and developing this uh, concept solution of a flexible manufacturing system by um, creating an intralogistic solution made of a smart box and the smart box is essentially a box which uh, contains the product and has the ability to trace and uh, collect information as the product travels through the factory. The AMRC introduced several solutions. Digital work instructions stepped the operators through the assembly process. The smart tools ensured right first time tightening of fasteners. A modular and adaptable fixture incorporated a load cell which detected the addition of each component in the assembly and we also incorporated a camera to capture continuous improvement suggestions from the operators. This project has been great and it's brought two key manufacturing uh, catapults together, uh, bringing their individual expertise into making integrated manufacturing system. IBM's role in the project was as the technology partner. We had several areas to look at. One was to look at the information architecture and the other side to it is to create a kind of reference architecture, an enterprise technology framework that could show how all the components the answer within the system connected together. The API support we managed to speed up the development and prototyping of these technologies which means for us that we managed to start introducing them quite early than we initially expected. The workbench produced showcased AMRC's capabilities and allowed us to integrate fourth industrial revolution technologies into production. So the ATI is looking to support the development of new manufacturing technologies that support UK businesses. This was a great example of where business wanted to adapt and, and recognise how it could utilise the technologies available. 